hello hello my beautiful wolf pack oh welcome welcome if you're new please hit that subscribe hit that bell button button so you could get the notifications hit those likes and i appreciate if you share today we're having a party here because you know the, the colors are changing on the lamp all right today i wanted to do that because since we're doing all the um you know the zodiac signs today um so thank you for joining me today again like i said it's zodiac signs i do it with one card for each of the island time wellness oracle cards i knew my moon could show you real quick okay and um if you're joining me from tiktok i appreciate y'all so very much for joining me from there um please share if you know anybody else that would like to hear these type of messages okay or um if you want to um join me on tiktok is the same name queen will tarot um also i did the uh sorry the love readings and the work and money a little late this week so if you catch those uh, i believe i posted yesterday um friday okay so we're gonna create the negative energy around us again i'm putting the lights you know we're having a little light show here all right so here we go let's clear any negative energy around us very nice very nice very nice hold on a second i need to move this a little bit here we go okay now I'm going to ask my beautiful guys to please bless and protect the space. I ask that you ensure only trustworthy answers come from the divine through these cards. I ask that you let me see, hear, feel, and know the messages you have for my wolf pack. And I ask that this reading brings blessings to everyone involved. So it is, so be it. sorry now everyone in case the video gets cut off at any moment and the whole um you know for the whole duration of my um the zodiac signs but i, I cut and i try to make it as fast as i can because again it's just one car read i will continue in another video with the other signs just in case this gets cut off okay so what do you have here please and thank you what do you have here please and thank you for my Beautiful Aries. One well, nice to have you for my Aries, please and thank you. Okay, I need it to. Sorry, I want to make sure I have this right. Sorry, I had it. I don't like reverses, and I had it in reverse. My, my apologies. I don't know. I'm being. I don't know. If, I, I, is Aries here being very distracted? I don't know why, but I feel very distracted for some reason. I don't know what's going on. You know, after the 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 uh so, sorry the the what is it called? My gosh. The eclipse yes thank you for somebody who said that but anyway let's continue Whoa. all right aries okay healthy choices aries you got healthy choices okay and it says making healthy choices in love and in life self-love self-care being happier so whatever things you have to let go that didn't benefit you or that doesn't you know is it doesn't work for you with mentally emotionally okay um, from the past is, is again making healthy choices as far as um, if you're having somebody new in your life or um, even if it's um, whether this is eating whether it's you know drinking whether it's whatever it is that you have to um, make healthy choices about and, and especially with people that you choose to make it you know to be in your circle or make the same choices about you know like if you see somebody the same we always tend to be drawn to the same people i don't know why but try to make like healthier choices when it comes to that my beautiful aries okay so i hope that resonates love and light okay let's go with the beautiful taurus let's see my message you have your peace and thank you for the beautiful taurus wow that's great all right taurus ascending and look i said wow that's great <laughs> without even seeing it it's ascending as you can see it there it says, um, transcending obstacles, learning, expansion, new phase, preparing for union. Hmm. So maybe now you're um, about to, you know, reunite with someone. Um, 
also it means you've learned a lot of things from you know leaving situations because the balloon is like you're flying you're, you're taking flight meaning freedom some somebody had obstacles before um what you learn from those obstacles now you're expanding right um and again a new phase so preparing for union could mean a new a new person if it's a new phase for you okay um bottom says healthy choices i didn't get the bottom energy for aries i apologize but um you know everybody else if i was supposed to get the bottom energy i was talking so much with one card that i, I didn't get to do the bottom energy i apologize if aries is watching taurus um but making healthy choices you see in love and in life what did i say new phases okay learning from other things and or from past and going on to new adventures okay my beautiful taurus but i hope that resonates love and light oh if we saw this from the beginning, we're having a show today. Okay, take care now. Okay, let's go with my beautiful Gemini. One message, please and thank you. Okay, I need it on the table. One message, please and thank you. You have it for Gemini. Oh, wow. The runner. It's funny because I believe you got this last time, didn't you? Was it you, Gemini? I'm gonna check my, my video again. But the runner, and it's um running codependent relationship fear of intimacy listening to ego so it could mean again you somebody's here constantly chasing someone that you know your fear of of maybe you love that person so much that you they don't you know you feel if you let go you know is forever and you don't want that right um but it also could mean um letting go of you know fear also because that could be you're, you're constantly you know someone could be liking you or like this car says in the bottom someone could be liking you and because of you holding on to a fear of you know listening to your ego of past things and and things that have happened to you before you don't let new things come in your life my beautiful gemini and it says someone likes you romance is blooming fun flirting want to date hello what are we talking about here? okay so these things are letting go of, of the of your codependency of of you know of, of bad habits of other relationships that you've had and just go with new stuff all right new people how's that in your life right or running away from that maybe the run is for you running away from all these other toxic things that were in your life my beautiful gemini okay so i hope that resonates love and light okay let's go with my beautiful cancer oh cancer you got here wedding rings ooh, 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 ooh. you got wedding rings so it says union wedding marriage i don't know why i'm putting it all the way over there when i should put my lighting hold on let me put my lighting a little closer so that way you guys can see the cards a little better there we go i hope it stays on here because this is a problem perfect sorry if i didn't adjust it before but this is um make sure it doesn't want it doesn't fall all right so Oh, and I think you have something under? No. Oh, I thought it had something under. Weird. Um, but again, wedding, um, union, a soul connection you have with somebody here. Um, everlasting promise. So somebody's getting engaged. Somebody's going into another next level in the relationship. Okay, somebody's going into a marriage. Um, or you're having just a, a nice connection with a soul connection. Like you're going to meet somebody that you feel you met before in a past life. And you make that good, good connection. You make that, that, that you know, that beautiful connection. And the, energy, um, the bottom energy, you got clock, which is need times, takes time, in time, cycles, time to heal, progress. Okay, my beautiful Cancer. So for whoever this resonates, okay, I hope it resonates with you. Love and light. Okay, let's go with my beautiful Leo. Okay, they are coming quick now. Mirror. You got mirror mirroring each other self-image relationship reflect our wounds introspective so it could mean that you, you you're with some okay this is a specific message for somebody that some that you're with somebody that's kind of they're exactly like you um so somebody you could be dealing with another leo um but it's just somebody you know you're mirroring each other constantly um reflect our wounds so it could be that you know constantly is, is remembering like every time you have an argument you remember of the past argument so that brings up those wounds again and um 
you know the the self images that maybe some some of you guys they make you feel like you know victim um they they feel like they they make you feel like they're the victims or you know or they make you feel like you're the bad person right so this is mirroring each other so maybe this is a, a situation of letting go of these things right um but maybe it's somebody here that's constantly um how can I say, um, very, very um, argue, argumentative, arg I don't know how you say that, or argue, argue, argue what? <laughs> the word don't come out, sorry guys. Um, argumentative, something like that, right? Um, but wedding rings at the bottom energy is, hello, self-connection, so eternal love. So again, if you're marrying each other and you're soulmates, then... Um, just be careful of all things that, that are brought up all the time, all the time. Maybe it's to let go of those type of things, right? Um, stop the arguing. Or maybe the other person has to stop those arguing so much with you, right? Because, again, it's vice versa here also. All right, my beautiful Leo. So I hope that resonates. Love and light. All right, let's go with my beautiful Virgo. Maybe I won't mess up any words here, okay? I messed up the words in here. Ooh, here we go. All right, my beautiful girl, Virgo, your healing, healing heart. I love that one. Healing from heartbreak, freedom from a toxic relationship or addiction. It's funny because I believe Virgo got the same card last time. I'm gonna check again my um my my video to see and rewind it to Virgo because I think you got that same one, but somebody's still healing here that hasn't been finished, right? It says here mirroring each other, self-image, relationship, reflect wounds. I guess somebody hasn't healed completely here yet. What are we talking about, right? Um, sorry, you know, the lights, I wanted to put a little party today. It's Friday. All right, I mean, sorry, Saturday. Um, so again, this is mostly you healing. Take time, so you know, you take time. Let go of certain toxic and addiction things, maybe addicted to somebody or addicted to, you know, certain um, things that you do or the person does, okay? So I hope that resonates, my beautiful Virgo. Love and light. All right, let's go with my beautiful Libra. Fellow Libras, whoop, whoop. My beautiful Libra. Sorry, I don't know if I'm moving the camera here a little bit. Sorry about that. Let me just fix it. Okay, let's see what message you have here for my beautiful Libras. Uh-oh, we got two of them. The bottom one, okay, no. Uh, sorry about that. If it comes out, I saw healthy choices, but if it comes out again, is yours all right but i want it on the table one message you have here okay two again what's going on all right you got twin flames yin and yang balance union duality coupling com complement each other okay and then it's funny because the bottom energy that the one that fell out with it it says hammer sabotage rebuilding it repetitive persistent working on it so for what i feel here somebody's trying to out of self self sabotage a situation here with a person because you doubting is you doubt maybe you have trust issues and you're doubting so much maybe maybe even the truth sometimes the the telling the truth and um <clears throat> you've been hurt so much that with the even when the truth comes out it's suspicious to you i mean when they tell you the truth it's suspicious you understand so but I believe this is, like I said, this says yin and yang. So maybe, again, the, the sabotage here could be you or could be this person. So sabotaging or, you know. But also it says rebuilding. So maybe here, if, we, if you are with the twin flame or you get back with you or with a person that you feel that they're twin, twin flame, then this is working on it, right? Working on it. The bottom energy you got was love. <laughs> okay? Okay? Unconditional love. Self-love. Passion. Affection. Attraction. So there is love there, right? But stop sabotaging. I don't know, again, if it's you all in your head, constantly overthinking, or it could mean, um, you know, sabotaging it. With, oh, the person, I'm sorry, vice versa, okay? But I hope this resonates, my beautiful Libras. Love and light. All right, let's go with my beautiful Scorpio. Let's go, Scorpio. Okay, photograph photograph oh you got two of them okay you got photograph looking at your photos missing you nostalgia make new memories and then sunglasses <laughs> watching looking stalking <laughs> perception focusing out okay so looking at photos and stalking so somebody's either you are stalking someone's social media 
pictures or you're reminiscing about you know um a person that you, you have been with before right or again vice versa someone is doing this about you somebody's constantly looking at old pictures of you guys and or they're looking again at your social media to see how you're doing right because they could be um wanting to sabotage you so be careful because these people um you know they're gaslighting they could be gaslighting you because sometimes when they see you doing good and they're not good you know misery loves company so be careful scorpio if you know it's a person fun so make new memories forget about anybody else you know but again just be careful if somebody's talking somebody's looking at your stuff be careful what you post be, be careful the things you know so they won't sabotage you in any way if, when it comes to in your life right or in your family whatever and look the hammer see sabotage again but rebuilding all right so persistent be persistent okay so i hope that resonates my beautiful scorpio love and light all right let's go my beautiful sagittarius everybody's beautiful right Sagittarius, let's go. Ooh, okay, I want it on the table. One message, and if that's yours, it'll come out. Um, heartbreak came out, so let's see for who. Okay, sorry, I need one more. One message, please, and thank you. You have here for the beautiful Sagittarius. All right, no, there's too many again. What is going on here? I guess they don't really want to talk to you. Ooh, look at these. What is going on? And they're still falling out. Okay, one piece. Thank you. Okay, the phoenix. New phase. Rekindle. Renew. Transformation. Growth. Changed mind. And I saw this one that came out. It fell out and it fell out again and then I put it back. But again, didn't I, see, didn't I say heartbreak? Look at heartbreak there. Pain. Separation. Deception. Shocking. So again, this is a new phase for any um, shocking attack. So for whoever is letting go or whoever... Um, Again, you're starting out new because of a separation, because of a deception that you have, Sagittarius, or of someone stabbing you in the back, right? Um, but it's a new phase, my love. New phase, okay? Renew, transformation. Rekindle could be for you, but of course, I hope it's not somebody that did stab you in the back because we don't do those, right, Wolfpack? Um, change the change mind. So this is for you um, to start a new. Phoenix is like everything beautiful, everything like an abundance, okay? So, um maybe start new start fresh just let go of people's you know people's um stabbing and stabbing you in the back all the time okay so i hope that resonates my beautiful sagittarius love and light all right let's go with my beautiful capricorn again if any at any moment this video gets cut off i will continue in the next video right, thank you all right you got not enough and coffee cup okay frustrated in a relationship look at confidence self-sabotage fear jealousies okay meeting and conversating feeling uplifted friendships okay somebody here feels that maybe in the, if you're frustrated in a situation of uh, you know relationship this is time for you to go out take time by yourself go out or uh, whatever that is um, you know with that person we'll <sighs> let it go take a time again take time out one day to go out with your friends go have coffee if you don't like coffee or have tea if you don't like tea have a drink how's that okay or have other something else that you would like to have with your friends but it's out to have some fun to talk and to let go of something here Oof. let go of something here look i didn't notice there was another one under but look what it says there the sword and the rose clarity truth revelations okay protection power so oof, i'm loving that so again here protecting yourself because that sword is protection and be careful also clarity could mean that maybe somebody here acts like they the rose a beautiful rose and they got thorns underneath so okay be careful so go out talk have you know have clarity maybe a friend of yours could give you clarity on this, your situation okay my beautiful capricorn all right so love and light all this resonates love and light okay let's go with the beautiful capricorn my beautiful i'm sorry capricorn aquarius i just did capricorn my beautiful aquarius please and thank you <clears throat> my beautiful aquarius please and thank you Ooh, you got the butterfly the butterfly relationship evolving to the next phase healing the inner child growth so here's somebody's going in step step up we're going to a step up the bottom energy is sunglasses watching looking um be careful with someone here that's um trying to um stop your growth here okay because you're up to the next phase and here it says you know 
um, somebody gaslighting, stalking, looking. So again, be careful. You, you've been healing a lot of things here from your past. You know, you've again growth here, like I said. Um, so a relationship with you could be a relationship with yourself, right? Well, we're, we're, again, healing your inner child so you become better relationship with yourself, right? So that's what the butterflies there because you're evolving, you're, you're, you're transforming or you've transformed. So look, don't let anybody here gaslighting you to try to stop you from that, my beautiful Aquarius, okay? Um, just continue with your beautiful self, okay? So I hope that resonates, love and light. Okay, last but not least, let's go with the beautiful Pisces. Let's see what last message. Okay, hold on. Last message you have here for Pisces, please and thank you. All right. You have, oh, all right. I'm going to take this one because those two... It says talking, interested, conversating more, awaited message arrives, text, call, email, hovering. So it could mean, again, somebody here that needs to speak to you about a certain situation or something is coming up. Um, interested can mean about work also, because talking can mean anything. It doesn't have to mean with love or anything like that, although this is the love oracles, but it can mean about work also. Somebody been waiting here for some work that they going to love here. Um, or again, it could be a, a person that you've been waiting for to uh, for the call, the text, or the email, right? You're getting a new mess. You're getting that message from that person because of talking. And it's welcoming love, meeting the one, opening hearts, getting to know, getting together, perfect. So somebody that's holding somebody's heart, you know, the key here, right? Because hey, it is what it is. We wait. We always waiting, waiting for somebody, and because they have the the key to our heart. And it's, um, you know, sometimes we waste our time, but hey, it is what it is. And um, if this, I hope you're not doing that. But if you're just waiting for someone to get you a message here, then you're about to be receiving it. Okay, my beautiful Pisces. All right, so I hope this resonates. Love and light. All right, guys, we came to the end of the video. I appreciate every single one of y'all. I hope everybody got to hear the messages. And I hope you got to hear the ending because I always thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. All right, so if it resonated, everyone, please leave a comment. I appreciate that. All right, so take care now. Love and light. Oh, bye-bye.